Okay, here's another one for sale. This is a 1979 Dodge Palomino. In the late 1970s, Dodge came out with a lot of uh, different model styles that uh, you may remember. There was originally the Warlock, the Little Red Express, the Midnight Express, the Macho Series, and then several of these that were basically trim packages in different styles. This was called a Palomino based on the color and the graphic stripe and the unique seat covers that it had. Um, of course this is a 35 year old truck so it's uh, got a little faded from wear and tear but it's not a bad old truck as you can see it's running uh, it's titled it's uh, ready for restoration to the right buyer uh, the trim package on this we know where to get the uh, replacement seat covers the graphics detail probably have to be redone so it's got a few bumps and bruises from the years only one uh, pretty good size one I'll show you that in detail as we go around the truck um, it's a 318 automatic transmission uh, two-wheel drive long bed uh, you ought to go on Google these things they're pretty rare I've only found that I know of this one guy in California says there's about hundred and forty of them so he's got several and I've got this one that uh, I certainly don't need. I've got 11 other trucks that are uh, in various stages of restoration. So I've got more projects than I can handle. So let me take you on a close-up tour of this thing. I'll point out the, uh, the problems with it. As we get some close-ups on it, You'll see some of those normal chips, scratches in the paint. Here's a set of tires. Got the nice baby moons. We trimmed the beauty rings. Right now it's running on a straight exhaust, so it's a little uh, loud. It sounds really cool out here in the country. In that gra graphics strip along the side. Show you the inside from this way. Radio works. The uh, carpet has been removed. You can see there's not much rust on the floorboards. And that steering column lever has been broken off. Don't know who would do that, something like that or how they could do it, but you can still shift it by holding on to the column. Here's a aftermarket saddle blanket type cover. I don't know if I can pull the original back out of here or not. I know I could somewhere. There it is, don't know how well it shows up. You can see it's wore out. See the Palomino logo on the tailgate there? And here's the major body damage. It has a dent along this rear corner. Not too bad though. Shows a little rust from the paint sealing off that uh, 
that damage. Got the nice bigger mirrors for pulling. Got the trailer brake control. Slide in here. And we'll rev her up. Let me pull the hood latch. There you go, the good old Reliable 318. They've been making these things often more or less the same since 1958. Got one in another truck with over 300,000 miles on it. Pretty smooth running. So if you'd like this truck, if you're interested in it, give me a call, 970-986-1020. We may be negotiable on the price on this one. Uh, give me a call if you got any interest. Thanks for looking and have a great day.
Porque lo mandó el Creador Cuando se derrama sangre Nunca es posible el perdón Con lágrimas en sus ojos Se despide de un amigo Papá ya su corazón 